Hey everyone, it's Fitz with your daily delivery. Hope you're doing well. I am wonderful. We had our first football press conference of the season. Our weekly ones have started now. I didn't do a walk and talk because I was going to do it on here. And then I had another topic to do on here. And then I saw that K-State released its new basketball court design. The court is in place. First, a reminder, I'm not going to tell you to subscribe and I'm not going to say all that other stuff, but interact with this video in any way you can. K-State was going to have their court finished up right before basketball season. In fact, the original schedule was, would we get it done in time for basketball season or would we have to like kind of put it down after the season started? Well, they got it out of the way. They released pictures of that new court on Tuesday for the public to see. And I'm going to steal a couple uh, quotes from people that I respect. One of the great K-State Twitter accounts, Ema Caleb, replied with this. I'm whelmed. He wasn't underwhelmed or overwhelmed, just whelmed. Our own Ryan Wallace said, very safe and very conservative, very K-State. I, I agree with all of that. There's nothing wrong with the court design. In fact, it's really likable, really clean, very basic. It's a beautiful shade of wood with purple lanes, a big power cat in the middle, the big 12 reversed out of those purple lanes. At one side, it says Wildcats and the other side in the, in the script, in this script, it says that script right there. It says Wildcats. So that's new. And then it says K-State, Kansas State, whatever on the other side. That, there's no lavender. I wore my lavender like I typically do for K-State basketball videos. And there's no lavender on the court. This reluctance with the lavender with K-State is beginning to annoy me a little bit. It is something very unique about this institution and something the fans, for the most part, absolutely love. And the lavender goes back, well, into the 70s with K-State basketball. But again, very safe and conservative, just like the institution that is Kansas State. Now look. One of the most annoying things in college sports is a blue football field at Idaho, in Idaho at Boise State um, and just overwhelming designs of basketball courts at ex example, Oregon, trees, and TCU, frog skin. I don't know what that is. They're distracting, they're annoying, and they, they take away from the game. Whether you're viewing in person or on TV, being whelmed is much better than overwhelmed by a design. A little lavender would have been nice. Just maybe the lanes in lavender with the purple Big 12 logos. Can, I don't know. Besides, I'm never going to stop pushing to start calling the court the cradle of coaches court because of so many great basketball coaches that have come through Kansas State. And I feel like anyone viewing should be reminded of Gardner, Winters, Fitzsimmons, Hartman, Kruger, Altman, Huggins, Martin, and Weber, and now Jerome Tang. I bet you Jerome Tang wanted some lavender. Did they overrule Jerome Tang on lavender? I don't know. I have to ask. But overall, whelmed. Nice, but whelmed.